In a bid to hide evidence, Mueller claims Russia will use discovery from junk bot case to spy on witch hunt and Americans by Christina Layla for the GatewayPundit.com. Robert Mueller's team came up with a new excuse as to why they don't want to cough up over 70 discovery requests by indicted Russian company Concord Management and Consulting. Mueller's liberal hack lawyers claim Russia could use the evidence they gather through discovery to spy on the witch hunt and American citizens. That's right. Mueller is arguing a case he brought to court is now a threat to his own investigation. (laughs) You, You can't make this stuff up. Associated Press reported special counsel Robert Mueller's team is worried that Russian intelligence services will use a criminal case in Washington to gather information about about its investigation. Oh my. Prosecutors are asking a federal judge to impose limits on the information that can be shared by attorneys for Concord Management and Consulting LLC. The company is accused of Uh, funding a clandestine Russian social media operation aimed at interfering in the 2016 U.S. presidential election. So far, only one defendant, Concord Management and Consulting LLC, has appeared in the case, and prosecutors say they're worried information they provide to the company's attorneys could end up in the hands of other defendants on Russian spy agencies. Mueller's team says disclosure of the information could compromise American sources and methods for monitoring foreign intelligence uh, interference operations. Where have we heard that uh, the sources and methods before? We've heard this time and time again, and it's nothing. Prosecutors also want to bar other defendants from accessing the materials turned over in the case until they appear in a U.S. court. That includes Yevgeny Prigozhin, a uh, wealthy businessman who controls the company. He has uh, ties to Russian President Vladimir Putin. Indicted Russian company Concord Management and Consulting wants to play ball and blasted Mueller in court recently, telling the magistrate judge the government has indicted the proverbial ham sandwich. Concord is seeking all of Mueller's evidence of the so-called conspiracy as part of their discovery rights. Mueller's PR stunt is backfiring and it is glorious. Former U.S. Attorney Joe DeGeneva recently blasted Mueller for indicting a case prematurely. They, meaning Mueller, indicted a case prematurely against people they thought would never show up from Russia. And then one of the Russian companies hired lawyers and sent them to court to say, we're here and we want to plead not guilty and we want a lot of discovery on your criminal case against us, DeGenova said. (laughs) This is so good. This isn't the first time Mueller's lawyers went to great lengths to evade discovery requests in their own case. Mueller has been begging a federal judge to indefinitely delay the junk Russia bot case since he rolled out an indictment prematurely. Last month, lawyers defending Concord Management sparred with Mueller's liberal hacks in court. Concord Management's lawyers began by accusing Mueller's team of ignoring over 70 discovery requests. Rather, Mueller's team offered to give Concord Management's lawyers a massive amount of social media data from those dangerous trolls who sought to influence the U.S. election. And the majority of it is in Russian. (laughs) It got worse. Mueller's lawyers admitted that they 
don't even have English translations for the Russian social media posts. Dirty cop Mueller is not prepared to go to trial, which is why his corrupt lawyers are once again using the old excuse, discovery could compromise sources and methods. I knew it. I didn't even read the article. That old excuse. I said it myself. Man, I should start writing my own articles, it seems. But I couldn't think of everything. No. <laughs> But I, I, once I heard that, that, that line there, that, uh, that, uh, that old, what did they say, uh, discovery, uh, c compromise uh, sources and methods. I mean, it just, that, that just rang right in my ear because we're sick and tired of hearing this garbage. I didn't know about this before the, uh, this Mueller thing going on. But it, it, is, it, it is actually hilarious. At the same time, he's a disgrace, a disgrace. He has no qualms about becoming a disgrace uh, and disgracing our country like that, too. You know what I'm saying? Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.